straight arm pullovers, okay? Those are great for your abs, for your back, for everything in between. So, Shelby, go ahead and put the dog down, grab some dumbbells. While Shelby does that, I'm gonna take my dumbbells and I'm just gonna do a double arm over a press. So again, we've got the bands on our legs, but we're working our arms and our back and our abs. So, right out of breath, I'm sweating. So Shelby, work your way down like that. Keep your wrists nice and tight. I'm gonna go to just basic dumbbell press. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and down. Okay, put those out of the way for there. Now she's gonna take hers. She's gonna safely get to her feet. She's gonna do 10 overhead press while I do 10 jump squats. There you go. Dump the weights if you need to. Work your way back up. Good. So now turn around, face the world, stomach tight, flip them up, and just nice and smooth overhead press. Let your palms move around. So palms to your ear on the way down. Turn your palms around like that. And then go up and twist them. So like that and up. So you want to find nice, happy tracking. You feel that left shoulder clicking? I can feel that clicking. That hurt. I'm sore. <laughs> yeah. Actually, my muscles yeah. are fatiguing. So here, she's getting tired already. We're going to do the same one arm. We do one arm at a time. Okay. So one arm. Okay. So find a nice, happy, get a little bend in your knees. Nice, strong base. Suck in. <laughs> And find a nice happy tracking with that shoulder. That's important. Roll that arm around. You don't want to feel too much of that clicking. There you go. Is that a little better? Yeah. Is that too heavy? No. Okay, good. You're strong. All right. So that's why sometimes single arm overhead press is better than a double arm because it allows you to really find that tracking. No arm is the same. So I'm stalling. This is my microphone. Them jump squats are getting me. All right, where are we at here? You're doing the overhead press. Looking good. Make sure I'm losing my microphone here. That, how's that feel? Feeling good? Main thing, don't try to arch your back. And just do something that doesn't hurt your shoulders. Okay, good. All right, move right along. Two more sets of that, guys. Keeping it going. Shelby's still doing the straight arm pullovers. One of the best ab, tricep, back exercises you can do. Straight arm pullovers. I still got the leg bands on, I'm almost done. We're gonna switch that around. I wanna do one more set of some good pulling. So I'm gonna do some heavy inverted rows. This time I'm gonna throw my feet up on this bar to get even higher up, to make it even harder on me. And I really wanna focus on pulling that squeeze, holding that shoulder blade squeeze for about two seconds. Shh. Legs up, hips up, pull, two, down. One, two, two, three, four, five. All right, looking good, Shelby. Feeling good. Uh, come behind you. Overhead press, double arm. Shelby's closing that down. I'm gonna go ahead, release the band pressure on my legs. Peel that band off. Field some questions from our audience. Yes, dear. Yes, dear. Come on. This is what happens when you have kids. Is that life? Life goes on. You gotta do whatever it is. You gotta do. 
Okay. What do I do? Okay. All right. We're almost done. We are running out of time. Okay. So go ahead and deflate your leg bands, mommy. Grab your arm bands. We're going to close it off. So we did a little back, a little leg. Now we need a little arm. So up first, you can take those arm bands. Make sure this is large. I've got the large. <laughs> right out of time. Okay. So I got righty and I got lefty. What I am going to do first is I am going to inflate my bands. We're going to do just quick bicep, tricep, shoulder series. So anchor that left one on, tubes connected. Just like this, just like that. And again, if you both have your own Katsu Cycle 2.0, this is a lot easier. But it's all right if you don't have it. It's a good team building exercise, okay? Those are in a good position. Quality time with your significant other, especially when you're locked down in some sort of quarantine situation. Okay, so <clears throat> I'll turn mine on. We're doing training. We'll do 250 for my arms. So then I hit the red button. It's gonna swell up to right about 250. Once we get to that position, boom. Okay, there we go. So now what I am gonna do is I'm going to disconnect my bands. Make sure, make sure you don't drop it. No bueno. Hit the red button. Cuts it off. Mine are inflated. Mamacita, you put yours upside down. But that's okay because I'm here to help. Here. It's all right. Luckily, you have a Katsu Master Specialist. So for Shelby, I'm not going to put her at 250. She'll punch me. So we'll go at 180. So hit the red button again. It's going to fill her up. Not too bad. How's that tightness? Good. Feels good. Right. Feels okay. Good. So your arms are going to be crying here any minute. Okay. So now we are both untethered. We are both disconnected. We are both going to burn our arms up. Do it. Let's do it. So, Mamacita, you're, I'll take the heavier one. I think this black one here is good for you. All right. Cooper Dog, let's move this out of the way. We're gonna do a superset, bicep, tricep. Take the band, step on it, wiggle it around. First, we're gonna go thumbs up. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna curl, pull your thumbs out, up and out. If that's too easy, wiggle the band around a little bit, step on it some, so you can see my feet here. So you can get a little bit shorter, however you want to adjust the tension. So we're gonna aim for 20. We're gonna do three sets. So try to hit the first one at 20. Two, three, four, really squeeze it. Pull up, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Good. That was a good one, huh? Okay. Yeah, take your ring off. All right, so bicep, tricep. So now we're gonna superset with a tricep kickback. So mama's got one strand. I've got a loop, I've got a circle. It's a little bit harder. So for her, she's just gonna bend back and do kickback. For me, since mine's looped, I'm going to step behind the front. Again, we're trying to hit 20. One arm for me? Uh, both arms, oh. so just like that. So now, However, you're going to do it. Kick back, kick back. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Ah, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eight, nineteen, twenty. Oh, Flick my mic. Okay, how you doing? It's burning. It's burning. Okay. So first set, we got 20. Keep it going, no rest. Back to the bicep. 
Step on your band. <sighs> Trying to get to at least 15. Two, three, four, five. Oh, seven is burning. Eight, <laughs> 10, 11, I'm cheating. 12, 13, 14, 15. Okay. <laughs> okay, all right, almost done, halfway. Halfway there, halfway there, halfway there. Shake it out. If your arms are burning, throw them up. Okay, how you doing? Good. Doing okay? All right. Good. Triceps, keep it going. Kickbacks, try to get to 15. Same thing. Super set. Nice, simple. Tricep, kickbacks. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, oh my god. Arms are burning. Right back to bicep. Keep going. Last one. Last one. 10, nice and slow. Slow 10. Slow 10. Slow 10. One, two. This is already a bad idea. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> oh, she's sorry. My arms are burning. Okay. This is why you're supposed to start with triceps. Because then it gets hard to do the last set. Okay, last one. But for some reason, everyone always starts with biceps. Okay, last set, 10. Nice and smooth. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten. Oh. Okay, okay, so hit the little button, hit the plunger, deflate it, oh. grab the other one, deflate it, take the band off, unstrap it, pull it off. <sighs> All right, so that was pretty good workout. Arms pumped up, back's feeling it. A little egg, a little egg, a little legs, 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 abs, back, arms. And I got to hang out with my best friend. What beats that? Thanks for coming, guys. Hope you guys have a great day. For Corey and Shelby, see you. See ya.